This right here is the crown of the Holy Roman Emperor, and it was stolen back during World War II. And allow me to explain. I'm sure that a lot of us are aware that Germany did a lot of, um, annexing back during World War II. With the first major target that was on their list being Austria. Austria being the successor state to the Holy Roman Empire, they had a lot of regalia there from the good old days from the previous thousand years, including the crown of Charlemagne. And actually, since this was the crown of one of the great uber-Germans of history, yeah, the, um, the, 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 the no-no mustache men really wanted it. Like, a lot. Now, this wasn't the only piece of art that was taken by the no-no Germans. It's one of those really funny details in history, but the, uh, these people ended up stealing just about every single piece that they ever came across, like every kind of major artwork that you had in Europe at the time. If the Germans could get their hands on it, they were going to take it. With the idea that the bad mustache man had being that they were going to create a super art gallery in Germany that was going to house the greatest pieces of art all around the world that was going to completely overshadow the Louvre. Of course, the Germans actually ended up losing the war, and the crown was instead found in a bomb-proof bunker. 